Hi guys, this video is requested by my very good friend Stacy about how to put on individual lashes. So um, I have some individual lashes here. They're from um, Andrea and they look like this. Um, yeah. Um, they are fair, uh, they are flare short black lashes. Um, it's the shortest one available in store. And if you have bigger eyes and longer natural lashes, you can definitely go for medium and long lashes. But they work really well for me. And uh, I got them when they were on sale. So uh, the whole package was a little bit more than $3. So it's not very expensive. You can definitely get um, a lot of sorts of brands of uh, individual lashes in drugstore. I usually use four clusters of individual lashes per time. I use two clusters here and two here. Um, they're very different from regular false lashes because regular false lashes give you very dramatic looks, especially when you don't really have very full or long uh, natural lashes. But they just have very nice enhancing effect on your lashes. So uh, you can create a wing out effect with uh, individual lashes. Okay, so now I'm going to use the tweezers here to remove one of the lash clusters here. To use dual eyeshadow glue, uh, you can put a, a little bit of glue on a piece of paper or folio, but uh, it's just easier if you just dip into here. Okay, there's a glue ball on the tip. And then you let it dry a little bit to make it tacky and then slightly put on your outer corner. Okay, and then I usually put two uh, clusters here and two here. If you have bigger eyes, you can put more of course, and you can of course layer them. The tricky thing here is that you really need to uh, spend time figuring out which angle is the best for you to put it on. Oops, sorry. Uh, where should I put it? Okay. You don't want to touch it too much because um, it's still very slippery when you first put it on and then when the glue gradually dries out, it'll be firm. Okay. Um, it's the same for the other eye, but it's harder for me because um, I'm right-handed and it's tricky to do the left side. Oops. So now you want to put on a little bit of mascara so that they can blend into your natural lashes. Um, I know most of people like to apply their mascara this way on their natural lashes, which is definitely the right way to do it. But they're really... Not, not necessarily fragile, but since the band is so tiny, it's very easy for them to move around if you push too hard. So usually I just um, use my uh, mascara wand this way, vertically, and just uh, swip on the clusters. Right, okay. Oops.
yeah, that's how you do it. And as you can see, I'm not very excellent at that either. But I mean, you have to. Um, they're very easy to play around and uh, it's very, very hard to mess up with individual lashes because if they don't go with your whole look, you just pull them out and put them back in. Um, it's really a fun thing to do and give it a try and you might like it. Thanks for watching. Bye!